Georges, by Alexander Dumas is a poignant tale that delves into the complexities of human nature, the consequences of societal expectations, and the enduring power of love. Set against the backdrop of 19th-century France, the narrative weaves together elements of romance, tragedy, and social commentary, showcasing Dumas's mastery in creating multifaceted characters and intricate plotlines. The protagonist, Georges Munier, is a man whose life becomes entangled in a web of societal norms and personal desires. At the outset, Georges is portrayed as a young, ambitious lawyer, driven by a sense of duty to his family and society. However, as the story unfolds, it becomes evident that his internal conflicts are as compelling as the external challenges he faces. Dumas explores the theme of societal expectations and their impact on individual lives. Georges' engagement to the affluent and charming young woman, Suzanne, is a result of familial pressures and social conventions. The author deftly exposes the facade of respectability that conceals the true emotions of the characters. Georges' predicament mirrors the struggles of individuals caught between their own desires and the expectations of those around them. The narrative takes a dramatic turn with the introduction of Marion Delorme, a courtesan whose beauty and charisma captivate Georges. Dumas skillfully navigates the intricate dynamics of love and passion, portraying Marion not as a mere seductress, but as a woman who yearns for genuine connection in a society that condemns her. The forbidden love between Georges and Marion becomes the focal point of the story, challenging societal norms and questioning the morality imposed by a judgmental world. Dumas employs vivid and evocative language to create a rich tapestry of emotions. The intense love affair between Georges and Marion is painted with strokes of both ecstasy and despair. The author's portrayal of their clandestine meetings and the emotional turmoil experienced by Georges adds depth to the narrative. Through these characters, Dumas explores the limits of societal tolerance and the consequences of defying established norms. The tragic element of the narrative is heightened by the inevitable collision between Georges' personal desires and the rigid expectations of society. As the walls close in on the illicit lovers, the reader is compelled to empathize with their plight. The author masterfully uses tragedy as a lens through which he examines the human condition, exposing the fragility of happiness in a world governed by societal norms. The secondary characters in Georges play crucial roles in shaping the narrative and highlighting the disparities in social class and morality. Suzanne, the jilted fiancé, embodies the sacrifices made in the pursuit of societal approval. Her character serves as a poignant reminder of the collateral damage inflicted by a society that places reputation above genuine human connections. Similarly, the antagonistic figures who condemn Georges and Marion reflect the harsh judgment meted out to those who dare to defy societal norms. In conclusion, Alexander Dumas's Georges stands as a timeless exploration of the human experience, unraveling the intricacies of love, societal expectations, and the consequences of defying the status quo. Through the tragic tale of Georges Munier and Marion Delorme, Dumas invites readers to reflect on the enduring conflicts between personal desires and societal norms. The narrative, rich in emotional depth and social commentary, captivates audiences with its exploration of the human condition in a world that often demands conformity at the cost of true happiness.